video, I'm going to explain what obsessive compulsive disorder is, or OCD. Okay, OCD is an anxiety disorder, and it has two essential characteristics. The first one is recurrent or persistent thoughts. And these thoughts are about harm, something bad happening either to you or to somebody else. And in your mind, you are connected to this harm. You have responsibility for this harm, either for doing it or preventing it. So the second characteristic is linked to that. The second characteristic is a behavior or a ritual. And this ritual is intended to stop the bad thing happening. Now, we all have tendencies to overthink things, to ruminate, to have thoughts going round and round and round in our mind. And we all have little routines and rituals that soothe us. But OCD is the next step on from this. All attempts to stop those recurrent thoughts just make them worse. And if you attempt to resist your rituals, your routines, you find your anxiety building and building and building to an almost unbearable level. And the only thing that makes it better is to do the ritual. Now, the term um, obsessive compulsive is used incorrectly in relation to things like drinking or eating or gambling, because all of these things are actually in the moment when you're doing them quite pleasurable. They only hurt afterwards. With OCD, or the burden of OCD, is that there is no pleasure in it. The only thing about it is that short-term relief of tension once you have completed the ritual. And that's important. It is a short-term relief. Because shortly after engaging in the ritual or doing the behaviour, the thoughts will return and they will bring the anxiety with it. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to run you through a quick quiz so you can identify if OCD is the problem that you're dealing with. Because the first step to resolving this problem is identifying that that's the problem. Okay, so the first question, do you worry about the harmful effect of germs and maybe spend an ex excessive amount of time cleaning to avoid that, ha that harm. So maybe hand washing or cleaning your ha house, wiping surfaces, for example. Do you check and recheck things like door locks or switches? Do you have lots of unwanted thoughts or images about accidents or doing harm to someone like stabbing them or poisoning them? Do you hoard things? Do you never throw things away? Do you feel compelled to be perfect? Do you struggle to make even very simple decisions? Are you compelled to memorise quite, quite ordinary everyday things like licence plates or numbers or instructions or labels? Do you feel compelled to follow quite strict routines around ordinary tasks? Do you find that you get very upset if something isn't in the exact same spot all of the time? Are you often very late because you're struggling to get through ordinary tasks? Do you find that in order to get through ordinary tasks, you have to count? Now, if you've answered yes to one or more of these questions, it's quite likely that you are suffering from OCD and that you could really benefit from some counselling. So I'm going to put a link to the description of this video to some helpful information about counselling, where you can get it and what it involves. I hope this was helpful. Thank you for watching and I will see you soon.